Hey, what's going on guys? So I wanted to do a quick video today because I want to show you a trick I've used earlier this week to help one of my clients. So it's a little bit sketchy and a little bit controversial, but I still wanted to show you because it might be important to you guys if it's used the right way. So here's the deal. A client of mine just started a new business. Okay. So it's a new business, but he, he's been doing that for a while. Okay. So it's not like he's starting from zero and he doesn't have any experience. And he contacted me because we're already running his um his ads on on his real business on the current business okay so he wanted some help over uh on his facebook page creating the new page create creating the whole thing you know I, I jumped on the occasion to help because we specialize in facebook ads instagram ads and tiktok ads here at autobahn digital and i felt like it was pretty easy for me to set up the whole thing for him and uh, we had a discussion on what he was trying to achieve, launching his new business, creating his new page. He was a little bit confused on what to do exactly and how to promote his services. So within the next five minutes or so, I'm going to show you exactly what we've done to uh, give him some social proof around his services and new business. Hey, real quick, before I forget, um, subscribe to the channel if you don't want to miss the next videos i like to do marketing videos and sales marketing videos as well growth hacking that kind of stuff to automate your customer acquisition but at the same time i really want to know what's your current issue so if you're if you own a business an agency right now let me know in the comments what you're looking to do uh what kind of issues do you have and so we, we can discuss if i know how to help you i'll do a video for you so let me know and um yeah subscribe to the channel just to make sure you don't miss anything in the future since my client had just started his business we had to create a new facebook page to run ads to right but there's two major issues when it comes to facebook pages one a new page doesn't show any activity right there's not going to be any posts and two you only get one like mainly because it's the business owner that likes his own page right i don't know about you but if you get to a facebook page and it shows like one like or seven like or even less than 100 likes i find it very hard to trust um if you know what i mean so we had this very specific issue and the business my my friend and the business owner was like you know what is there anything we can do to get some likes because he, he felt like it was not professional but in this case it's it's really it's, it's really funny because it's not a new business a new environment for him he has been in this business for 15 years he's doing mortgage loans and uh, he's just been working under a banner this whole time and he couldn't have his own identity and own, own branding. OK, so this makes sense for him. Um, I wouldn't do it if, you know, you're starting uh, like a business from scratch. It's, it, it's a little bit deceptive. But in this case, he knows what he's doing. He is accredited. He has hundreds of past clients, you know, but he really wanted just like a quick shortcut to give him a chance to serve more clients in the future in case they go on this on this page so like like i said number one for activity that's pretty that's pretty easy i just advise every single of my clients when this happens and they when they feel their facebook ads or sorry their facebook page is not you know vibrant enough or populated enough i i just tell them you know google a bunch of things in your industry and just share the links uh basically to get the ball rolling he wanted to give like social proof to his page and just then move on right because he's doing a couple thousand dollars in ads every month he just didn't want to lose anyone because they felt like he was not it was not trustable enough because he really knows what he's doing if you're in a similar position whatsoever uh listen closely because i'm gonna show you in the next two minutes exactly how to do that i'm gonna share my screen because i just want to give you the full picture before we get started you can do a lot of sketchy things in marketing but in some ways if there's like a gray area i think like this one you could just use this simple, super simple trick like we did just for one week and then you move on to some other um, issues in your business. So I do not recommend putting importance on Facebook likes nowadays. OK, it's not 2012 anymore. Page likes are pretty much irrelevant now. If a page has tens of thousands of likes, it doesn't mean they're successful. OK, and if you've been on Facebook for a while, especially if you have a Facebook page, you already know that the organic reach keeps shrinking every year i got clients they got twenty thousand likes and when they hit post they reach like 200 people so it's it, like it's done okay so i'm not doing this for reach i'm doing this just for social proof that's all okay so the goal here was to provide as many likes as possible for my client or as little as possible but obviously he asked me how many likes will i get and how much would it cost me for every like my answer was I didn't know, but I'll try something. So let me go over to my screen right now and I'll share exactly what I've done with these guys. And my client was pretty happy because we were able to get 
from 40 likes to 5,000 likes in a matter of a week and they've been paying under two cents per new like just to be clear we're not expecting any real clients no sales from these likes okay it's just uh and you shouldn't either if you want to do the same thing so let me jump to my screen i'm going to show you exactly what you have to do okay cool so let's do this here okay so what i'm gonna do i'm in testing mode here um so i'm gonna take a random page of mine I'm just gonna create a new campaign i'm in uh, facebook ads manager um you should uh, if you don't have this it's pretty it looks impressive at first but it's not so bad to understand as you use it um if you ever want to do this and you're you're not used to that just follow my steps one by one pause the video go do that pause the video again and then keep going okay it's gonna be fairly um fairly simple so you want to choose engagement as your goal you keep buying type as the auction we're going to continue like this i'm just going to choose engagement campaigns call it cheap likes no cats and then daily budget i'm gonna this i'm gonna put maybe 10 bucks a day i'm gonna do this i'm gonna do this experiment for my own page okay so let's do it here I wanted people to engage with my Facebook page here. I don't want a message. I don't want my ad. I don't want to drive people to a website or an app. So I'm going to just use this here. I'm going to use my own page. Keep going. And then this is where it gets interesting. I'm going to choose. I'm Canada right now. So I'm going to just choose worldwide. And then I'm going to have a pretty decent estimated audience here. I want to exclude any country where I know cost per click is really higher. Okay. My goal here is get as many clicks as I can. So my dollar is stretched to the most, um, to its most extent. Okay. That makes sense. Canada. Whoop. Let's say United, uh, let's say Europe as a region. Okay, let's exclude here. Then all gender, all ages. I want to go, I want to stop it at 25. Younger people are more click happy. I want to do this. I'm going to leave everything I want here. So I'm basically asking um, Facebook to advertise my own company here. Okay. As a, I'm, I'm going to add a quick, it doesn't, it doesn't have to be fancy. Okay. So what I want to do is pretty much show this to everyone who, uh, is most likely to like my page where it's easy to, to get a click, you know, where people are click happy on the like button. Okay. And I want also make sure I don't infringe any policy on at, at Facebook. So the goal here and the, my, my trick, my tip to you is to like, keep it simple. Let's say I'm going to run an ad that says, we're helping businesses advertise online. That's it. Okay. So then I'm going to choose my own pixel here. So what I really want is I'm going to say I'm helping since it's my own page. There you go. There you go. And that's it. Okay. Gonna call it empty helping worldwide. And then that's all that's all you need so i'm not expecting any sales any real clients out of this i just want to boost my page here because you know um i'm gonna show you something see i got 12 followers or nine likes okay this is my own page i like to push things here it's just a matter of I don't really use this page, but I guess I could boost my likes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to use this my own page as a, a guinea pig in this in this case and do the same exact thing I did for my client. And um, I'm going to post. Make sure you subscribe because I want to post a video when I'm done. Probably it's going to be a short or a TikTok. So if you want to go on TikTok and find me, Mark Lavoie HQ, uh, it's the same on TikTok, Facebook, Instagram and then uh, Twitter. Let me know because I'll, I'll be posting the results when it's when it's done in about a week. 
So I'll be putting $10 a day for 10 days, uh, maybe so hundred bucks. And I'm going to see exactly how many likes I'm going to have at the end of this, uh, of this week. So let me know in the comments, what you, what you think. I know it's a little bit uh, shady, a, a tactic, but at the same time, I just want to make sure, um, you know, if you want to use this in, in, in your business to boost your number of likes, if that's important for you, if you want to show a social proof, you can you can basically game the system like this. So I've done this before, so I know it works. I, I wanted to take an example on my own page and I want to make sure you can use this technique as well. So it's pretty cheap. You should be able to get likes for maybe two cents. So it's fairly um, impressive. I suggest you do it and then you move on. OK, just don't go crazy because at some point some people are going to ask questions and it's going to be weird if your business has a million likes at some point and uh, no engagement. OK, that, that's a different problem. Let me know if you liked it, if you hated it, if you think it's shady, if you think it's smart, let me know in the comments. The next videos are going to be much more sustainable in terms of tactics and marketing strategies. So let me know in the comments what you think. See you in the next time. Cheers. Thank you.